Hello, people of the internet. So today I will be teaching you how to install Rethod on Linux. This is going to be specifically for Ubuntu and Debian based distros. I can't guarantee you this is going to work on other distros, but I know that it will work on Debian and Ubuntu based distros. So today I'm using um, Kubuntu. It is a Ubuntu distro with KDE Plasma as the GUI because I like the way it looks. And just as a forewarning, I'm very new to Linux, so all you Linux fanboys out there, please spare me. I know you guys can be kind of abrasive. So, um, yeah, enough of the bullshit. You are going to go to this website in the description to download the base game. Um, that, that is the base game for Tony Hawk's American Wasteland, which Rethought is based on. For those of you who don't know, Rethought is a mod of Tony Hawk's American Wasteland. Very similar to Thug Pro, but a lot better, honestly. Um, so I have the game data right here, and I also have the app image, which major shout out to F. Canudo. Sorry if I pronounced that wrong. Um, he made this app image. It was made for Steam Deck mainly, but it also works on Linux. So you are going to, you know, install the base game and just put it on your desktop or whatever. And then you are going to, well, first what you have to do is you have to install Wine. Yeah, I don't think that worked. <laughs> yeah, okay, so this issue I had the first time I installed it as well. So I'm going to completely uninstall everything and reinstall it and hopefully we don't have this issue again. So cut to me 30 minutes into the future. <laughs> Okay, so two weeks later and like five reinstalls of Kubuntu later and I finally have Rethod working on Ubuntu. So my problem was is that I forgot because the thing is is that I got this working on my ThinkPad. It was working great and I went to do it on here and I couldn't figure it out. So I forgot that you don't need to use the command line to install Wine. You can download it straight from the software center. So I... <laughs> spent all this time like racking my brain and getting pissed off trying to figure out how to get this shit installed when I could have just downloaded it, you know, in an app store the entire time. So it's finally working. Um, it's running absolutely horribly because it's on eight gigs of RAM and like two CPU cores. In fact, the score meter is still in the corner. So it's running, but you know, if you run it on a better v uh, virtual machine or if you're running it, you know, on hardware, then it'll work perfectly fine. Um, so yeah, um, I cut off like the entire part that I recorded where I was in the command line and I, uh, screwed it up. So let me just close this. So I will say this, that you still have to do, um, what you're going to do after you install wine. Let me go there just kind of to show you. So it, it, on Ubuntu distros, I'm not sure about Debian distros, but you know, they should have, um, a, some sort of software center, an app store, essentially. And that's where you can download Wine. And it should work perfectly from there. You don't have to do anything else. You download that, you download the game files, you download the app image. And um, I don't think you have to chmod to run the app image, but it doesn't hurt. So you're gonna do, well, my bad. You're going to go to where the file is, you know, so, and then you can do open terminal here or you, you can navigate to it if you want to so change directory, whatever. You're gonna do chmod plus x and then the name of the file. So rethod.exe. That is going to tell um, the operating system that it's an executable file. I'm not sure if you have to, but I recommend doing it just in case. And I would do that for both thaw.exe and rethod.exe just in case. I mean, I don't. it's not running you know, the actual game itself but you, you never know just to be on the safe side it doesn't hurt and that's really all you need to do so just make sure you don't do what i did and try and unless you really know what you're doing and you're good at the command line and you're not stupid at it like i am then just go to the app store the software center wherever install wine and then install the updater and then launch rethought and you should be good but you want to make sure that you can't just double click the game because if you do it's going to ask you where to do it and wine isn't an option so you're just gonna whenever you if you want to open the game you just gotta open in terminal and then do wine rethod 
Exe. And you can see how slow it is. I, man, this thing is really slow. Yeah. That is brutal. I kind of, I kind of just want to go in the server real quick and see what happens. This is probably really unsafe to do, but I'm just going to do it anyway, just to see if it works. Oh man, dude, this thing might crash. <laughs> Dude, I've never seen a map load that slow before. <laughs> I think it's going to crash. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh man. <laughs> yeah, I'm using keyboard. Oh, that's rough. <laughs> I can't believe I haven't crashed yet. That's wild. Okay, I'm going to close this. Man, that hurts. So yeah, that's all you need to know, basically. Just make sure you install Wine from the Software Center, unless you know what you're doing in the command line. And then install Thaw from the link that I have in the description. And then download the updater app image that I have in the description. And then run the, update, run the updater and run rethawed through wine and you should be good so if you have any questions just hit me up and i'm on the game all the time as ndx so if you see me in the game or you want to comment on this video just you know if you have any questions let me know yeah i think that'll do it thank you guys for watching see ya